I say, Mr. Ackerbacker, sir, do you fancy a flutter? Oh, well, uh, what would you recommend? Butterscotch and snuzzle in the My Little Pony Derby, oh, old good form. Oh, well, uh, scientifically speaking, of course, a uh, form is simply an uh, assessment of different criteria relating to weather conditions, uh, previous history, and related information. Right you are, sir. It was only supposed to be a bit of thud. We have an additional race, in fact. It's the My Little Pony Derby. We're at Leafy Lingfield in Surrey. There are nine horse races going on, but nobody really bothers about them. Horse racing, very much secondary today. It's the Pony Derby, that big event covered by us. My little nowhere pony. <laughs> they were good. The going, I can report, is good to firm. Ponies, like soft ground, rule them out. They didn't move. Some were just stuck in that position. Like, Probably the gayest toy ever. And I hated it, and I hated anyone who had one. The company that made them did a survey, and they asked little girls what they see at night when they dream. The average response was, I see horses. And so they put that together with the pretty pastel colours that little girls love, which was just every girl's dream. Very desirable and very fluffy and ponies, pink colours, hair to brush and it should have been a you know surefire winner, but just somehow less than the sum of its parts. And the prices are coming in from the better ring is bottle two to one blossom. I can see one bottle going nine to four. A tic tac is sending nine to four the favourite, that's blossom. I dread to think what the manufacturers or the naming people were thinking about when they gave some of them their names. We have to find Spike and Lickety Split. This is Spunky the Camel. <laughs> the complete outsider number two, bookmakers don't reckon Bluebell's got a chance. I am a shocked mother of none about those names. Butterscotch. Butterscotch really being well back the five. Butterscotch is very much a flavour, you know, and that's all. And it's then on the shoulders, nine to two against Snozzle. You see, even saying the words Butterscotch Snozzle to me exactly explains why anyone who had one should be shunned. My name's Hope, and I have a My Little Pony collection. Minty, Bluebell, Blossom, Butterscotch, Cotton Candy, and Snuzzle. They're like sort of my favourite, but there's loads that I have that are like uh, twice as my favourite. I'm quite pony mad, actually. <laughs> I've met this fine chick now. She was hot. She was like Haley Berry studded. You know, and I said, like, can I, you know, can I hang up my coat? And I opened it, and I saw 900 My Little Ponies. Safe to say that me and I ain't making love that night. <laughs> right? I'm going home. This is Jeff, my husband. When I first started collecting ponies, he thought it was just a one or two, like a one-off. But now, he collects them with me. Uh, every time he sees a pony, he gets really excited. You can get things like all these games, and like a My Little Pony sleeping bag, and My Little Pony duvet covers. Bizarre items like pony walkie-talkies. The books. The videos. <laughs> Bean bags. The clothes. The brushes. Dream Castle, which is one of the most famous buildings. The scarves, the, the, the coats, the hats, the earmuffs. A lot. <laughs> Why would you want to do that? I have no idea. No, you have to have like, more than one, because once you get that first one, you're just like, oh, I need more ponies, I need more ponies. And I've already told prospective males that they will have to put up with that sort of thing in their lives. I've even joked that I want them melted down and put with me in my coffin. So. <laughs> well, what do you think Molo Pony brings to our lives? Or our little ponies, I should say. Um. What's the words, really? They're under started orders, 
and they're off for the Pony Derby. What a break Minty made. But look at the yellow butterscotch. It looks as though the punters have got it right. They're coming close home. The favourites in front blossom. Minty dropping right out of contention. It is very close, but butterscotch gets up on the line. The Pony Derby is won by good old butterscotch. Well, here we all...